You're watching Fox 45 Good Day Baltimore. All local, all morning. Well, St. Patrick's Day is this Saturday, and you don't have to go to the bar to celebrate. Coming up, everything you need to throw the best green theme party in your neighborhood. You're watching Fox 45. Good day, Baltimore. Oh, these Irish eyes are smiling. If you're looking to celebrate St. Patrick's Day at home, you're in luck. Entertainment expert and influencer Amanda Mastro is joining us with some tips on throwing that perfect party. Thank you so much for coming in. You look great. Thank you. This I'm is ready. perfect I'm for ready. the day. I'm going to start early <laughs> for St. Patrick's Day. We're going to go right into the weekend. See, I'm not surprised <laughs> that you're ready. It's getting the men in our lives ready that can be difficult, and you're helping us do that. Yes, I am all about more is more, so I've got the glitter and the green for myself and my kids, but my husband is like, hard pass. Yeah. So I actually <laughs> went to I went to Men's Warehouse and found some great green plaid shirts that I knew that he would Perfect. wear these to. He'd wear them to work. He could wear them for St. Patrick's Day. These yeah. this particular brand is called Igara and also it has a special formula in it that it doesn't wrinkle as much because oh. then he's not asking me to iron because Very nice. you know, we don't want to do that. <laughs> <laughs> and then you can just have him wear this hat on top and, and the outfit will be complete. Yes, there you need goes. a little bling. Let's talk about some of the food <laughs> options here. It could be a little festive with the hat. Okay, Ooh, so balance. a lot of times most of the drinks and the snacks for St. Patrick's Day is a lot of just adding green food coloring, right. which is kind of gross, to be honest. So <laughs> it is. Let's start with something that's already yummy and delicious and green, and then give it some Irish St. Patrick's Day inspiration. So I'm just going to start with some guacamole, because love who it. doesn't love guacamole? And I really like this Yucatan 95% av avocado, so I'm not cutting up avocados. You're just going to boil. It's done for you. It's done already. It's delicious. If you boil some potatoes, mash it in. It's creamy, yummy. It's kind of like a leprechaun dip. I can smell it right now, too. So good. And then I actually just made these little chips out of little cookie cutter shamrock. So really everything cute. is super festive. We need something to wash it down with. We Come on, it's St. Patrick's Day. What do you have do. here? Okay, so this is sh uh, Schaffer, uh, sorry, <laughs> Schaffer Hoffer. It's yes. a fun name to say. Schaffer Hoffer. It. It's actually a German beer, so we're going to cheat a oh, little I smell bit. the grapefruit. It is a grapefruit. It is so yummy and refreshing. We're going to make a cocktail out of it using the Schaffer Hoffer, and we're going to mix in some Irish whiskey, some blueberries. There you get your Irish so in So delicious and it's mm -hmm. light, refreshing and the grapefruit, I mean, it makes me think of warm weather. It sounds good. <laughs> and the Irish, you know, colors, Ireland has orange in it too. Exactly. So, that, that works so together. super delicious. I love this like light grapefruit taste. Perfect for for spring. And if you're having a party, you gotta have, you know, just some some serving wear to celebrate. Yes. So these are just Tervis cups. So fun. Where'd I love, you get them? Um, you can actually get them online. I've seen them at all different specialty stores, but what I really love about this is that you can use them every year. So it's bring them out this yes. year, bring them out next year. Super adorable. Great for kids, great for adults. Yeah, that's good. That's yes, nice because it's super fun. It's not gonna break when my three year old drops it. Yes, on the floor. it drops it. And so they have a ton <laughs> of different patterns, and I just grabbed a couple that had the St. Patrick's Day themes, but they've Cute. got, you know, themes for everything. You were talking about really getting the family involved in this when we talk about our kids and right. they could help you with a DIY project to help really decorate your home. Exactly. So I love this idea of just taking a wine bottle and here's a little trick. You just put a little baking soda, warm water. I spray painted it and used some hot glue to wow. attach the ribbon. Oh, yeah. And how cute is that? And some rope in the bottom and that little hat, that just came from the dollar store. That's so for really cute. Just a couple dollars and an old wine bottle. You have this adorable I decoration. Can do that. Thank yes. you so much. Happy St. Patrick's Day, Jonathan. Thank you. We're gonna turn it over to you, but I'll tell you what, I think we're the lucky ones over here. <laughs> Is there any wine in the wine bottle yeah. still? Because we can't. Not for you. Uh, and, all right. Mm. Anyway, uh, you can see here that.